Hey everyone, today I want to address something that's been on my mind recently. If you're a fan of the Fears to Fathom series, you might have heard the news circulating online that this could be the last episode. The creator, Ral, uh, Ral or Ral, uh, I'm sorry if I'm butchering the name, might be considering wrapping things up and I just want to take a moment to express why I think this incredible journey shouldn't come to an end just yet. First off, Ral, if you're watching this, I want to be clear. I'm not here to pressure or force you into anything. You likely have your reasons for wanting to stop and I fully respect that. But as someone who truly appreciates the work you put into this series, I just want to share my thoughts. These games are special. They're not just fun to play, but they also offer a unique experience in which players are placed into the shoes of characters who face terrifying real-life scenarios. The dread that builds up with each episode is palpable and knowing that these stories are based on actual events only makes them more chilling but also incredibly captivating. Now I understand that not every episode has the same impact, storytelling can fluctuate and that's natural, but that's also what keeps the series unpredictable and intriguing. In fact, it's, it's this very sense of uncertainty that pulls players in. We never know what horror awaits and that's the beauty of it. However, I'll admit that the latest episode left me feeling like something was missing. The twist, while interesting, didn't hit as hard as previous ones. Now don't get me wrong, this is in no way meant to be negative or discouraging. If anything, it just shows that there's still room to keep exploring, to keep surprising us. And while I offer my condolences to the victims whose stories these episodes are inspired by, I also feel that there's still so much more potential here. Rail, you've got a gift for telling these stories, so before deciding to close this chapter, I hope you'll consider ending the series with something truly unforgettable. You don't have to rely on user-submitted stories alone. There's a wealth of inspiration out there for, from infamous real-life cases like the Ted Bundy types to lesser-known but equally terrifying accounts. There's a lot more you can tap into. The Fears to Fathom series also holds valuable lessons. Every episode teaches players something, whether it's how to call for help, hide from danger, or to simply trust their instincts. The games blend survival strategies with eerie, cautionary tales that remind us to be cautious, especially when interacting with strangers. These aren't just horror stories, they're survival guides, and that's what makes them so impactful. So Rael, if you're considering ending these series, I hope this message encourages you to think it over. The games have helped countless people better understand the world and how to navigate its dangers. And for that, I just want to say thank you, and I hope to get to see more from Fears to Fathom in the future. Thanks for listening, and as always, stay safe out there.